All right, now we're ready to add the processor. All right, let's get this thing going. So this is the actual processor, so you <laughs> don't want to throw this guy away since that's what you paid for. And this is like a $10 heatsink fan combo Intel throws in for free, which is nice because for example in our instance, it's all we need um, There's some boring stuff on here and a sticker if you really want to tell the world that you have an Intel Pentium inside Okay, so this is probably the trickiest part of the whole thing. I mean as you'll see it's basically like putting Legos together. But here, you do want to pay a little more attention. You just want to be extra careful, uh, don't want to make any mistakes, pay attention to details, take your time, that kind of thing. So first, make sure that you have thermal paste um, applied to the heatsink. In this case, that's what these little blobs are. Uh, Intel has actually done this for us. If you have a third-party cooler, I mean, an older Intel processor, uh, you would need to do this yourself. You actually have to buy it. Um, it comes in little tubes. I recommend, I think it's Arctic Silver 9. or so It's, you know, the top-rated one on Newegg and YouTube. Anyway, for our intents and purposes, whatever stuff Intel put on here will be fine. Uh, normally, when you do it yourself, you would apply it onto the chip, actually. But I suppose it doesn't matter. Again, here's the processor and it's a nice little container. Uh, there's all the pins, you really want to be careful. I'm sorry, the pins are on the motherboard. Yeah, on the motherboard, these are just contacts, which is nice, makes it less likely to break. First thing is you want to unlatch. This little container um, uh, keeps the motherboard safe in shipping. So you can just kind of pry out with that and you have to use a decent amount of force and you have to bend it out like that and then it just kind of flips up and then as you keep you'll notice that the whole thing flips up and those are all the pins and that's why it has the black cover is to protect those guys in shipping